Directional, you have to put your. Yeah, to, yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll tell you so. You should know this already. I'm giving the instructions to Lizzie. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> Just a joke. space on the on the Bowery just down the road from where CBs used to be and um, and uh, they let us use it and it was like the best rehearsal space I think we ever had. They really it was like subterranean. They carved it out, just sort of made it like a nice little like clubhouse. It had all this all their old posters from like way back in the day and um, the cool big old gear. Carano cape. Yeah they did have oh, New York. Really? Wow. Yeah. I, just I like weird weird keyboards, keyboards of Nick's. Christmas lights on the ceiling. It was really nice. Really oh, a lot of Nick's photographs, <laughs> photographs, Polaroids. Yeah. yeah. No, it was dope. It was really Is cool. it? Does it not exist anymore? Nope. Is that why you're nah, Sam saw that. We fucked that all up. <laughs> <laughs> you guys trashed the place, and then they were like, "We're never letting that Interpol band back in our." No, we uh, we were a little loud, and and uh, a neighbor complained a couple times, no and the cops came a couple times, and Wait, the second this time. Is really it's true. Yeah, we got kicked out. We, we, they got kicked Everybody out. got kicked out. Yeah, and the story. Yeah. yeah, the cops came twice. Was it like twice in a week? No, no, no. it was like six months apart. I think. It felt like twice in a week. What did you say? I mean, I, I answered the doors for with my guitar on, and like over my shoulder, Sam, like in a drum kit, like all sweaty, and it's kind of like you know, What's that? noise. I don't know. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Not us. I think they thought I was paranoid because they wanted me for some. Uh, underrated transgressions. <laughs> <laughs> you're like, oh, you're just here because we're being too loud for you. Okay. 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 Well, it's a, uh, I guess that's a sort of, you know, auspicious but then destructive beginning to the record. You like ruin the, I guess, rehearsal space. But uh, something good happened there, apparently. Yeah, we started there and, and uh, we basically, at, at the end of, I guess, we, after touring out on the Elfin Tour, we took a little bit of a break. Uh, that was like at the end of 2015, or the fall of yeah. 2015, and we got back, Paul and I first got together, I played some songs I've been working on. <clears throat> we just had a setup like just bass and, and a vocal mic, and, and then within like a few days we carved out, we made some, some great headway of uh, some of the songs, and it was pretty exciting. And then Sam joined, I think that same session, or maybe the session after. It's like a week yeah. later. A week later, and then we just kind of were so on our way. The truth is, they only had one mic set up. He needed me to set up more mics. So. Sam, Sam help. Yes, like, we, to, we need you to start working on some songs. <laughs> He's really good with the mic setups. Yeah, it's yes, yes. evidence today. Um, so is it like, yeah, I'm picturing like a Sam bat signal. Like, okay, we, we're far enough along this time to call Sam. Oh, my thing goes off. It's like, oh, they're, how sweet they're trying to record. <laughs> 